Hi guys, it's Debbie. In my last video, I built a new system using this Western Digital M.2 250 gig solid state drive. After building the system, I ended up replacing this drive with a SanDisk Ultra 500 gig 2.5 inch serial ATA drive. I don't have another system which takes M.2 drives and I did not want this drive sitting around gathering dust so I decided to convert it into a 2.5 inch serial ATA drive. I converted it using the Sabrath M.2 SSD to serial ATA 2.5 inch aluminum enclosure. So here's how I put it together. Inside of the box you'll find some instructions, an extended warranty offer, a tiny bag of screws, a screwdriver, and the enclosure. To open the enclosure, you use the little tab on the back and just pull it open. Then you insert your M.2 drive and secure it with one of the larger screws from the back. Then pop the top back on and secure it using the really tiny screws that come in the bag. And voila! You have a 2.5 inch serial ATA drive that you can install into any system. I wanted to use this drive as a portable backup drive or data transfer drive, so I purchased this Sabrent 2.5 inch serial ATA hard drive slash SSD to US 3.1 adapter. Inside this box you get the instructions, extended warranty offer, the adapter cable which has a USB 3.1 connector on it, and a USB-C adapter. I apologize for getting out of frame here, but all you do is attach the cable to the drive. And if you need a USB-C drive, then you attach the USB-C adapter. And that's all there is to it. You now have a portable drive that you can use on any system that you choose. I ran the Crystal Dismark Benchmark app on the drive and here are the results of that. And then here on the right you can see the results on my SanDisk internal drive for comparison. Sequential reading and writing times are almost identical but the SanDisk did perform better on random reading and writing times. All in all I'm very satisfied with the Sabrent enclosure and adapter and the performance of the converted drive. I hope this helps you out. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.